55 pounds. His record is 14 wins, 5 losses. Please welcome a boxer known as Kenneth Mad Dog Penn. And his opponent across the ring. On my left, fighting out of the red corner. Entering the ring wearing black trunks with silver trim. He's originally from Melbourne, Australia. Now fighting out of the Jet Center in Van Nuys. He weighs in tonight at 206 pounds with a fine record of 11 wins, no losses, one draw with eight wins by way of knockout. He's the Australian and United States champion, ranked the number one contender in the world. Welcome the Thunder from Down Under, Stan, the man Longanetis. <laughs> Referee in charge, Santos Rosales, now to give instructions, seven rounds of kickboxing. Marcos Rosales, referee in charge. Gentlemen, I've already given you your instructions in the dressing room. Is there any questions? Okay, gentlemen, shake hands and have a good clean fight. coming in, and he looks tough. But, I'll, but I'll, I'll tell you from here, I've never seen him fight, so I really don't know what to expect from him. I've seen Stan the Man fight. He comes out quick, and he gets off hard. And he holds his left arm out straight at the United States champion, Longanitas. He was... Mad Dog was barking earlier tonight, and the Longanitas looked over at me and he said, where do they get these guys? <laughs> now, Longanitas, in his last outing, finished off Charlie, Mr. C. Archie, in less than one round. And it was a big right hand that uh, sent Mr. C to the canvas. in round number one a winner by way of knockout he's still undefeated and the new kick north american heavyweight champion stan the man longanetta stan the man longanetta the thunder from down under rumbles here in round one, he had coming in Blinky Rodriguez, the United States heavyweight title bout, and now adds to that the North American title bout. And I'll tell you what, it was four knockdowns within a minute and 25 seconds of this fight. Here's the first one, and there was no doubt about it. Boom. Right, right leg, left hook. That's a technique he's been working on. He hits a guy low to set that punch coming up around high. And, and the mad dog, he lay, gets up shaking his head, but he was hurt without a doubt in my mind. 
And this is the third knockdown right here. It started with the kick again and then a right hand. And I quite frankly think the Mad Dog was just overwhelmed. And then the final one that ended it all right here came about 15 seconds later. An overhand right. That turned Mad Dog around. And that was it. As the referee stepped in and said, hey, we've seen enough. There came the towel from the corner man. And I tell you what, it was a tremendous effort on the park of Stan Longanitas. I'll tell you what, I don't know if he can fight any better than that, Blinky. Well, I'll tell you, Stan the man is up and coming. He was yelling over the ropes to Dennis Alexio. Yep. Dennis Alexio is standing up, telling him, I want you too. So it's going to prove to make a lot of excitement for the heavyweight division in the kick uh, sanctioning body. And I'll tell you what, it's going to be a war between these two guys because they can both bang. They both got endurance and speed. Well, I'll tell you one thing, Blinky. That man right there, Stan Longanitas, uh, told me earlier tonight that Alexio has simply avoided him, won't fight him. He makes public claims, hey, I'll fight Longanitas anywhere, anytime, but privately will not sign a contract with Longanitas. At this point, I don't see how the kick sanctioning body cannot force Alexio to fight Longanitas or force Alexio to give up the world heavyweight belt. Well, I don't think it's that Alexio is, is avoiding uh, Stan the man. What I think it is is Alexio is waiting for the right promoter to pick up the match and pay the right amount of money for him to get into the ring. But nevertheless, this fight is inevitable. I think, yes, there will be the right promoter coming along to pick it up. There's interest in Melbourne, Australia, right now as we speak, to make this match happen there in his hometown. Yeah. It's going to be an exciting one, Phil. Well, of course, Longanitas claims, too, that Alexio wants so much money, nobody will sign either fighter to fight. Well, that'll do it. Boy, what an effort by Stan, the man Longanitas. It was short and quick. A minute and 25 seconds after the opening bell sounded, the end was here. The towel came in, and Longanitas remains undefeated. Don't